it's me, Juvie, and welcome to this week's Sub Saturdays. Ladies and gentlemen, as the name of this episode would suggest, we're going to be opening up my brand new beast of a PC. Before we get into that, I just want to thank every single person that contributed towards this, uh, mostly people on Twitch and on Patreon. Um, there has just been an extreme level of generosity. If you're one of those people on Patreon or uh, in the Twitch streams, uh, you've probably seen the, well, on Patreon, it's its own thing, but on Twitch, the gifted sub the bits, the donations, everything like that. Um, basically, it's just been overwhelming, and it has allowed me to finally upgrade my PC, which was sorely needed. Uh, if you didn't know, um, when ESO Somerset came out, I had early access, and during recording, uh, during the recording of it, my motherboard fried, and basically I got swindled at a PC store. They convinced me, for whatever reason, I don't know why I thought this would be a good idea, to go from a previous generation i7 processor down to an i5, and basically it's never been the same since. The motherboard has been worse, the processor has been much worse, uh, and I've always needed an upgraded graphics card. So because, again, uh, because of that generosity uh, over on Patreon and on Twitch, uh, mainly, there's other stuff here and there, uh, t-shirt sales and things like that. Uh, I was finally able to upgrade, and boy did I upgrade. Um, I got a beast of a PC, and uh, it, it would not have been possible, and I'm not just saying that, seriously. I literally would not have been possible, nor would it have happened uh, without you, if you were one of those people. And even if you just watch the stuff, you're contributing as well, so thank you. Thank you, everybody. Now, before we open it up, I just want to say this is a pre-built from iBuyPower, and I know right as I said that, everybody's going to type, everybody's going to hit that dislike button. Look. Uh, I, I've never been one to believe that you have to build your own PC. Um, I have had three PCs, including this one. First one, built myself, did the whole process. I, I know what it's like to build your own PC. Uh, and actually, I sold that to my girlfriend before she was my girlfriend, so she still has that PC. Um, the second one, I bought from iBuyPower as I was uh, in Florida, uh, going to my grandmother's funeral. It was around the time I think the um, Let's 100% Skyrim series first started, and I just needed a new PC to kind of be there when I returned. I didn't have time to, you know, build it or do anything. So I built that one, or I uh, I got that one from my by power, and the experience was great. It was everything that I that I wanted it to be. So I did that again. I went on iBuyPower, I picked out everything, I researched um, to no end, like like every single thing that went into this thing, from the case fans up to the to the GPU. So um, I know people are gonna disagree with that. There's, there's this sort of elitism thing where you have to build your own PC. I completely disagree and I'm totally glad paying a premium for this thing to be shipped uh, easily over to me and, and the cable management to be excellent and everything, you know, tested and in working order. And I don't trust myself to build a PC, uh, even though it did work, I, I think that I would screw something up. So yes, it is a pre-built. I know people are going to hate that. I know people are already typing. You should have built it your own. Get over it. Get over it. Okay. All right. Let's get into the build. All right. So here we are. There it is. It's a mid-size case. Um, I'm not even sure actually. This is my old one, and I think that's a full case because I remember the 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 um, the actual box being much bigger for that specific. PC. But there we go, there's the box. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pop this open, and I know I shouldn't be on a carpet whilst doing this because of static electricity, so I'm just gonna pop it open and then try to remove the PC and put it on something that's not carpet. So we're gonna go like this, it's very awkward holding the camera and doing this at the same time, and I also don't want to scratch anything. This knife is extremely dulled. I've had it since I first moved up to Colorado. Uh, it was like one of the first things I bought on Amazon. Fun, fun, fun story because um, I don't want to show off any information, by the way, which is why I'm not showing the sides. Uh, because I lived in a really bad apartment complex and I said, hey, I probably need some form of protection. So I bought, uh, yeah, this knife off of Amazon, one of my first purchases. Okay, so we should be able to just rip it open. There we go. Now I did pay for pretty much every premium with this because it was a very large purchase. This was easily the most expensive thing that I have ever bought for the channel. The biggest investment. Um, and so, you know, I didn't skimp on packaging. Uh, I got like the, you know, the extra, uh, padding or whatever, you know, it could be worth it. It could be not but I just didn't mess around especially when this was going through FedEx Which I did have kind of a bad experience with uh, but anyways, so here we go um, We've got let's see. What is this quick start guide? 
Okay, thank you for buying an iBuyPower PC. Like I said, that one was iBuyPower over there, and I really did enjoy the experience. So for what it's worth, you know, not sponsored, blah, blah, blee, blue, blah. Looks like they gave me all the cases for all the components, uh, and there it is. I got this, um, yeah, this uh, thermal, thermal take case here. I really wanted the three fans in the front because I saw this in action and it was quite pretty. I really did like it. So let's take a look at some of these boxes. Um, oh wow, that's great. <laughs> yeah, I had a bad, uh, I had a bad thing with, um, bad experience with FedEx because they, I swear to God, they didn't even like knock. <laughs> if they knocked, they did it the lightest knock possible. They didn't ring my doorbell. So I missed the, uh, the, the, the drop off. And then I had to wait a whole nother day to go pick it up. So I was wondering if during packaging it'd be kind of messed up and look so these are freebie headphones that came with it so I don't really care if these are messed up to be honest I already have like super duper expensive headphones right up there yeah uh, but there we go it's a little freebie um, also you get a lot of freebies with I buy power stuff so uh, we got a, um, uh, a free mechanical is this a mechanical gaming keyboard I don't I don't know actually if it doesn't say mechanical it's probably not uh, yeah, anyways, another freebie keyboard. Don't really care because I've got already um, a pretty, pretty keyboard. See, it glows. It's like rainbow. Um, okay. We also got another key. What? I don't remember having two keyboards, but okay. I didn't buy the. So this is the mechanical one then. Yeah, that's the mechanical. Okay. I, I didn't know that this was coming, to be honest. I don't know if they made a mistake or what, but that's fine with me. You can see there's like some sound foam and stuff that they've used to package it. Uh, what is this? Oh yeah, you also get a freebie little mouse as well, which is cool because my mouse is uh, probably going to replace it with this because my mouse is a little crappy at the moment. Uh, we've got this paper here, which I'm going to look at before I show you. Uh, da, 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 da. Yep, that's got all my info on it. Do not want to show you that. Okay, and then obviously the big boy. Uh, the big boy himself. Uh, let me... This is really awkward to do. So you can see the packaging that they've done here. Um, honestly, that's pretty, yeah, that's pretty good. Um, it's, it's, these are thick, thick eggshell sort of sound foam. Oh, and there's even more on the bottom. Okay, I'm not sure like how worth it that was, but this right here is very, very thick. So that's pretty cool. Uh, there is the box, the Thermal Take PC, level 20 MT ARGB. Uh, yeah, perfect. Okay, so I opened up the top. Uh, here we are. Uh, looks like we have some, uh, looks like all the manuals for all the components. MSI, that's my uh, motherboard. Okay, and then we have some little tube. Oh, this is probably, oh, this is another freebie, I think. Uh, this is a big, uh, big giant mouse pad. So that's kind of neat. Okay, I uh, like this, um, this sort of, uh, oh yeah, I, I pick at my thumb, so if you ever notice that, I'm a kind of a freak. <laughs> um, okay, so here it is, uh, and I, I really like this sort of, um, I don't know, this, this, this wrap, it feels quality. So let me grab, let me bring this thing out real quick. Okay, so I moved this thing over to this um, little uh, uh, office desk thingy, or uh, this, this office mat thingy. Shout out to my girlfriend who got that for me, uh, and I really needed that. Uh, so it's off of the carpet now, and... Here we go. Okay, that's the bottom then. Um, okay, let me put you down for just a sec. Take a look at Blue. He's over there. Look at him. Here, there you go. You can totally see him, right? I wish I could prop that up. Come on. Maybe if I do this. Blue, they want to see you. They want to see you, buddy. Okay, maybe. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Totally professional, by the way. Come on, man. It's like right at the... There we go. Okay, one sec. How's your day? How y'all doing? Oh, okay, that didn't last long. Oh man, all right. Hold on, hold on. We're close, we're near the end, I promise. Oh, yeah. oh, 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 geez, Louise, lemon squeeze. Whew. All right, there he is. Take a look at Blue. He's doing his thing, he's eating his food. He's camera shy. Okay, and here we go. So it's a mid-size. Yeah, I don't know. Is this bigger than that? It's kind of like the same size, I guess. So here we go. This is it. There's the PC. Ooh, I really like that front there. 
Yeah. Uh, so I customized everything in this entire PC. Um, oh yeah, and we've got the side panel as well. Let's turn it. So there we go. Um, so you can see through the middle. I might try to take that stuff out right now. And also catch my breath since I'm extremely out of shape. But there we go. There's the front. I wanted the yeah the RGBs. Uh, I'll probably do another video when this is when this is turned on, so you can see all the colors and everything. Um, there's the the top panel there. And um, yeah, let me try to get that stuff out real quick. So there we are. Um, yeah, the graphics card, the GPU, is a uh, GeForce RTX 2080. Uh, a lot of people don't like it because apparently it wasn't that big of an upgrade from the previous version. However, this is a massive upgrade from my previous uh, video card. Uh, we've got an M MSI motherboard as well as a Corsair liquid cooling uh, I forget what they call this thing, um, the, you know, like GPU, uh, CPU, I forget what the what the shorthand is for that, but there, there's the liquid cooling uh, for the processor, which is the newest gen i7. Uh, decided to not go with the i9 because it just didn't seem like it would be worth the price for what I do. Uh, we have got a 700 and p uh, 750 uh, PSU from Gigabyte. We've got some uh, Corsair RAM there. I just went for, you know, the 16 gigabyte. I don't think 32 is necessary. Now, I'm not seeing the other hard drive. I'm assuming they didn't screw me out of that and put it somewhere else um, because I got two hard drives. Uh, this is the SSD 500 gigabyte, and then I definitely got like a terabyte. Um, so I, I don't know where that is. I really hope I didn't get screwed out of that because that would suck. I'll try to find a way to like list the rest of the specs. Um, uh, if there's like something I can easily co uh, copy and paste from my email or something like that, I'll put it in the description. Uh, there's the front LGB or uh, RGB lights. And uh, yeah, I'd love to show you this all powered on, but there's a lot of stuff that I got to do before I can really uh, switch everything from that over to this. So yeah, really clean build. I really like how it looks. I went with white uh, for pretty much everything. And you can see uh, it just looks really nice, really clean. Like I said, I paid for all the premium stuff, you know, professional cable management, um, packaging. Uh, I just did not want to mess around here because this was, this was a very, very, very expensive investment. Uh, so that's going to do it, ladies and gents. Again, thanks to everybody that contributed towards this, what this means is now I'll be able to play pretty much every game maxed out. Uh, I'll be able to record, edit, stream, upload, all that stuff at, uh, at much better than what my PC used to be, which was already pretty good, but it still needed some upgrades. Now I'll be able to do pretty much everything, uh, and I'm very, very, very happy. So thank you uh, for contributing towards this. It should make the YouTube and Twitch channel much better. All right, see you guys next week or whenever. Um, oh, last thing is with the new series coming up on the channel, uh, this PC is necessary for what that's gonna be. It's a little teaser there. Okay, see you guys next time. Bye-bye.